Hello, what's going on guys and welcome back to another career mode episode with Cagliari. As you can see in the background I am facing Turek and sadly we lose 1-0. Now that's not a great result, I know, but let's look forward to the future as we play our first game this episode. I'm really hoping you, you guys will enjoy this first game. I've just I've just started YouTube so my editing skills aren't all that but hopefully it looks okay and hopefully you guys will enjoy it training there they don't do very well but Nico Nick Nikomuru still growing and here we go let's get into our first game kickoff Guys, I str let me be honest with you, I struggled to get into this game. It was a very difficult game from start to finish, but you'll see the end result. And it went through straight away with a shot that could have gone in, but it deflects off the defender and goes straight into the keeper's hands. Another attack now. Played through to Sal, but it's intercepted. They come forward again. Lose the ball again as I intercept. Play it forward. And we're through again to Sal. Sal to De Senna. De Senna surely got to put this away. It's going to be 1-0 straight into the keeper's arms. How is that happening, boys? Come on, get yourself into this. We go forward again, though. The ball falls to Sal. Sal trying to do something with it. L trying to do something with it. Loses the ball. Unlucky by Sal, but now they break. Played out to the wing. I'm trying to get back. I do, and it's a brilliant slide tackle. And get rid of the ball. We go forward again with Marco Sal, but he loses the ball again. He needs to step it up if he's trying to going to play for the Cagliari. I might drop him at this rate. They come forward. Lose the ball. We win it back. De Senna chasing. De Senna still chasing the ball. Wins it. Pass one. Pass two, the centre's on a roll, plays it through, oh, keeper parries it over the bar, it goes out for a corner, nothing comes from the corner but straight away after, the centre plays it through, intercepted, and now they break, but lose the ball, me tackling has been, I've been very good this episode, I'm tackling well, they can't seem to get through my defence, but here they go over the top and that's a penetrating ball, they should surely score from this, but it's a great challenge. Don't win the ball, though. Keeps it in the corner, plays it back. Keep on playing it between each other. It was played in, headed clear, and straight into the keeper's arms. That was close. Now we come forward. Brown one. Sh shoves the defender off the ball. He's going to have a shot. No, he's not. Why did I pass it? Marco Sal loses the ball. I'm not sure what happened there, guys. I don't know why I passed it. Now they break. Played inside to Balde. I'm not pronouncing that name, but it's a great ball through to Balde. Crosses it in. It's surely a goal. Oh, my God. He's missed a sitter from about 10 yards out. He's missed a complete sitter. And don't know what that was. I think that was meant to be a fake shot. That didn't really work, did it? I intercept the ball again and we go forward but they intercept slow football slow paced football this has been we've had a few chances this half but nothing's really come from it and they get a header but it goes out for a corner it's been a very difficult half no one's really had some solid chance well I have and I fluffed it completely and they just blazed across no one can get on the end of it and here we start the second half this second half was boring it was a very boring half nothing really came from it nothing really happened until like decent happened until the 80th minute I'm just gonna show you a few highlights of what actually happened yeah, as you can see we go through there's a good chance here face shot inside and straight into the keeper's arm he really should be sticking that in the corner skip to the 52nd minute now Blazing down the wing, he's still going, still going. Can he get across? And he does. Keeper gets in front of Sal, and Sal can't do anything with it. Skipping forward a few minutes again, 56th minute. 
played forward, but the defender easily cuts it out and they get away with the ball again. 75th minute, as you can see, I skipped a lot because this half has been very dead. There's nothing really been going on. They haven't had a chance. I've had two chances this whole match. And surely now is our break. Surely now he goes, he's, he's through. Oh, but he's offside. Not a good show in there. And somehow, for some reason, we win a free kick. 40 yards out. I'm not really going to, I'm not going to shoot from here. So I play it short, which could have been a bad decision as I nearly lose the ball here, but I shred a ball through. As you can see there, it's crossed to the back post, and Marco Sal makes it 1-0 in the 84th minute. Marco Sal, I told you he's going to bang in goals last, last episode, and he does that for me, right there. It's a lovely ball played in outside onto the wing, and a lovely ball played across to find Marco Sal at the back post. And all he has to do is nod it past the keeper. Here they go again. Trying to get something back now. So they play a long ball forward. But my left back's had a great show in. It's a great challenge there. Played inside. Lovely 1-2 football. Play through to Seri who I brought on. He cuts inside. Loses the ball but it goes to the left back again. He's going through everyone, plays it inside. Goes for a shot, deflected off the keeper. And Seri nods it over the keeper's head. It's 2-0 in the last minutes of the game. 2-0, Seri with a great head looping over the keeper. The keeper was brilliant, just couldn't get, couldn't retain. It was a great initial save. But couldn't get back up in time. And the head just goes, just nods straight over him as you can see there. I feel, feel bad for the keeper, but hey-ho. Sal plays it through to Seri. Seri, I don't know how I've got through there. He's through, surely. 3-0. Oh, no, he hits the post. He's kept the ball. De Senna into Sal. Marco Sal makes it 3-0. 3-0 in six minutes. How is it possible? Marco Sal. As I said earlier and last episode, he's going to be banging in goals. He's going to do brilliantly for me. Marco Sal. And that, guys, ends the game. A 3-0 win, all coming in the last six minutes. You don't usually see it. Oh, what a win. As you can see, we get our final scout report on Mason Bennett. Only 62 overall, so I'm not too sure whether to buy him, so i just stick him on the shortlist for now. You tell me if you want me to buy him. Also, we get a final scout report on Chris Jansen and Merkel. So tell me, guys, who do you want me to sign? Leave a comment. Who do you want me to sign? Leave a like, subscribe so you don't miss an episode, and I'll see you next time.